KTLA is there when LAPD's organized retail crime task force takes down a burglary crew accused of turning a big money theft ring into a family business. KTLA's Mary Beth McDade was with officers when they busted accused members of the so-called Dodgers crew. It's a story you'll see only on five. Hi, you guys. Yes, after months of investigating, LAPD's organized retail crime task force has busted a family in South LA for ripping off pricey perfumes at department stores all around the Southland and then reselling it. And they say it can prove to be quite a lucrative business. We got to ride along with LAPD's organized retail crime task force as they served search and arrest warrants at a South LA family's home. This is Los Angeles Police Department. We have a search warrant. Come on with your hands up. The Mendoza family is accused of stealing pricey perfume and cologne from SoCal department stores, usually at Nordstrom's and Macy's, in order to resell them for profit. They go into various locations throughout the uh, Los Angeles area, steal perfume, and then um, we were able to identify them, we were able to find them, and today we serve the warrant at their uh, residence. Detectives say arrested today, the father, 50-year-old Fermin Mendoza, the children, 23-year-old Fermin and 20-year-old Natalie, along with the children's mother, 48-year-old Gabriela Lopez, still on the loose, dad's girlfriend. Detectives say it's not every day you see several generations committing crimes together like this. The thing that we're out here for today is because it's a multi-generational theft crew. So there's a dad, what probably is his girlfriend or maybe a stepmom, and then two children, and then another friend that are going out and doing this. Uh, they are throughout the Southern California area, uh, from anywhere from Torrance, Glendale, a lot in L.A. Police say this is video of the family ripping off retailers. Authorities have dubbed them the Dodger Crew because of the Dodgers attire they often wear during the alleged thefts. Police believe they've committed dozens of crimes since coming onto their radar in December. A couple of them have been, they've turned into robberies where they've been confronted by staff that work at Nordstrom's or Macy's. The LAPD says the task force has seen some real success in cracking down on retail thefts since forming 10 months ago, thanks in part to multiple agencies such as Torrance, Santa Monica and Glendale all working together and because of their relationship with retailers. We work very closely with all of the department stores and retailers. Uh, they share information with us, we share information with them that we can. From here, investigators will be trying to figure out just how and where they're reselling this stolen merchandise. For now, in South LA, Mary Beth McDade, we'll send it back to you guys in the studio.